Well, the climax of the whole wheel building process is the final step of setting the tire. And that's what we're going to try to do this weekend. It requires a lot of help. And I've got a lot of friends that are going to pitch in this weekend and see if we can't get this done. What I'm burning here is cottonwood. I've split it up pretty fine so it'll light pretty fast. And this is going to be a great plenty. I would just as soon overkill. I like to have enough firewood around it that you really can't see that top tire. That's the one that needs to get hot first, but it has the least amount of coals that will work on it. The bed of coals as it burns down will actually heat up that second tire the best. But you cannot set cold tires. It's better to have tires that are too hot and deal with that because you cannot set a cold tire. Faster. <laughs>
Well, this first wheel went pretty much to plan. Everything went well, as you could tell. We went and started the second wheel, and it was pretty much a train wreck. Now, it's not anything new that hasn't happened before. It's just that the magnitude of a 10-foot tire kind of complicates things just in the physical handling when things don't go correct. So, this next video coming up, I'm going to show you what happened on the second wheel. Anyway, appreciate you following along on the good wheel. Next video, we get to see what happens when things go wrong. Thanks for watching.